NBA prize picks for Thursday, October 24th. I'm Sniper from DFS Army. It took prize picks a few days, but they have the NBA players on the streak game. So you can look at the top plays on NBA, break them down, throw in a top one, and move on from there. Get some of these streaks going. If you want more picks, plays, promo codes, tons of plays available for prize picks, underdog, sleeper, sportsbook, link down below, Sniper20, get you 20% off. That's all the intro promo I'll do for that today. Let's dive into these NBA plays. I'll hit the intro. We'll go to work. All right, first up, we're going to look at Harrison Barnes. We're going to look at the two-and-a-half rebound line. The tool we use at DFS Army is the Proptimizer. Let's compare prize pick line, sportsbook odds, and our projection model. Help you find those plus EV plays. It is part of the tool. And it looks like Harrison Barnes has been pulled off the board already, the uh, the uh, main board. So we'll have to do Harrison Barnes the old-fashioned way. For now, let's actually skip down. And we'll do Nikola Jokic, eight and a half rebounds. Sometimes these plays do get moved around. Let's see what we can find for Nikola Jokic. Looking at his rebound line at the moment. Set at 12 and a half right now. Oh, we're sorry. Look at eight and a half assists. I knew that didn't seem right when I said rebounds. Oh, man, eight and a half assists. All right, the odds lean slightly towards the over, but very slightly. It's pretty much a pick on minus 125 over on DraftKings, minus 105 for the under. Pretty much a dead pick Our projection model, 7.63. So we're projecting him to go under. He's been under four of the last five games. Denver taking on OKC. And this is four of his last five. Obviously, we're going back to. Oh, this is this is in the preseason, so it is worth noting preseason numbers. The last four, the form is going to be a little bit off. I actually made a wrong assumption here and thought we were looking at the end of last season. If we go back to the end of last season, probably a better way to do this. He still would be under in three of his last five games that count. Taking on OKC. Let's go to my uh, defense versus position chart here. Let's pull up centers. And let's pull up assists. And OKC does allow the third most, did allow last season. We're still on last season's data. I got to double check that. Yes. Did allow the third most assists per game to the center position. That being said, projecting him under first game of the season Dead heat on the pick'em. I would probably lean slightly. Would probably lean slightly towards the under for this one, but it is not a confident pick. I don't see how this isn't my least favorite of these three plays on the board. All right, let's go. Let's take a look. Let's go back to the Harrison Barnes rebound prop. I'm going to refresh here just to make sure that we don't have it available on the prop optimizer at the moment. And we do not have it up right now. So go ahead. We're going to really quickly go to a different monitor. And I will drag over my results here in just one second. Got DraftKings Sportsbook up. Go look for Harrison Barnes, who plays for the Spurs now. Still has the old Kings picture up. Player rebounds. Harrison Barnes, it's dead pick him. I mean, the over two and a half is three plus, plus 115. So your odds value is not going to help you too much on this play. Harrison Barnes plays a three. Let's go see, um, excuse me real quick, how the Mavericks defended the three, the small forward position last year. In terms of rebounds, we'll sort here. And Dallas did allow the seventh most rebounds per game to the small forward position last season. Problem is, is that Victor Wambayama you know, pulls down a ton of boards. Probably going to look at that in one second. The end of last year for Harrison Barnes. Again, for a different team, he's pulling down five, six, five, six rebounds. Averaged three rebounds per game last season. Your problem is going to be what Victor, Victor Wambayama does. You know, 
we have to look at him in just a second for 11 and a half rebounds. This is way, you know, this is under his average. They do allow a bunch of the position. I will favor the Harrison Barnes over for the two and a half rebound prop. It's a matter of whether or not I like it more than the one by Yama play. So we'll go over there. Now let's look at, take a look at Victor Wembanyama and his rebound prop. It looks like right now the Spurs have been, you know, I'm, I'm assuming everything's getting shifted around. Spurs numbers not available at the moment, but we can go do this the old-fashioned way. And we update that tool live throughout the day, so that can happen. It looks like to get over 11 and a half, actually plus money, a better odds, according to Vegas, on hitting the Harrison Barnes prop than the Victor Wembanyama prop. Interesting there. Let's head back over to the Spurs, and I'm just going to give myself to the Victor Wembanyama's page by going to the depth chart. I know he's right there. This, is, So we're looking at 11.5. He only averaged 10.6 last season. I mean only, but he was eighth in the league in terms of rebounding. End of last year, though, came on strong, went, un, went over the number in four of his last five games. And then if we go to the center position and start looking up Dallas there. Looks like Dallas a little bit better defending the center position, actually the fifth best uh, defense against the center position in terms of rebounding. So I would probably, I'd probably still lean towards the more just in the matchup with how he was used early in the season last year, I think his averages are a little bit off. That being said, though, more confident than he's only going to rank the place. I would go more than the Victor one by Yama over. Those are the three plays. If you didn't already, hit the like button. Let's rank these plays and give out my favorite. You've probably been able to read between the lines. I would lean towards the, the Nikola Jokic uh, less than eight and a half assists, but like no confidence in that play at all, just on the board. Silver medal, pl silver, silver medal play. Second pick, Victor Wambanyama, I would lean towards the over. But my favorite of the bunch is Harrison Barnes, more than two and a half rebounds. So we'll go ahead. We'll lock that in. That is the streak play for today. You want more full picks, plays, promos, make some money with us in the DFS Army Discord. Link down below. But for now, guys, here's that daily reminder that whether or not you are a DFS Army member, you probably should be. But either way, good luck in those contests. Let's cash this ticket, and I'll see you next time.